Hi guys, sir. welcome to Mini Numerical, sir. As per the YouTube video lecture, sir. Today I am with you uh, regarding a uh, load acting on pillow related uh, problems and uh, uh, formula. And another one also calculation of our tributary area and uh, what is tributary area and uh, related problems. Sir. So, first uh, move on to the first topic uh, which is uh, load acting on pillar. So, the load acting on pillar can be calculated from formula rho g d a plus b whole square by a square. Here, uh, rho which indicates the density of a super good super position rock and g represents the gravity and d represents the depth which is the overburden lying between the pillars and surface so this a plus b whole square which represents the area of this center to center distance square area of this center to center distance square and this a square which represents the area of this solid pillar solid pillar so the, this can be written as a so this as a for the extraction ratio this can be written as a uh, this this like so here uh, you can see in figure that everything is written so this is a tributary area calculations so first of all before going to the formula just we have to know the, what is a tributary area calculation tributary area so the area which is developed due to the formation of a galleries in underground mine the galleries which are formed so the area which is formed due to the formation of galleries is known as tributary area so this can be written as tributary area equals to area of a b c d this is the area of a b c d so this this area minus the area of a b c d small a b c d this is the small a b c d area so when we subtract this both then we get the tributary area so this can be written as a plus b whole square this is the one side and this is one side a plus b a, a1 plus b1 into a, a2 plus b2 minus this is a1 one side one side a1 one side a2 so this is the tributary area calculation formula so then move on to the question which is uh, related to the load acting on pillar so here uh, you can see the question so this is the question So first of all, uh, write the given data. Here, as per the question, vertical stresses are 8 mega Pascal. So this is 8 mega. Mega is equals to 10 to the power of 6, which can be written as like this. So depth is uh, equals to 200 meters, and average density is here. And uh, we have to find the extraction ratio. So as all we know that uh, load acting on pillow is uh, can be written as rho g into a plus b whole square into d. So load acting on pillow equals to stress acting on pillar into area of cross section of pillar. So here stress equals to load by area. From that we get load equals to stress into area of cross section of pillar. So this is the load acting on pillar formula. This this one. So here stress acting on pillar is all already given. So the area of cross section of pillars, which is solid pillar, we having uh, side of a square. So write the value of load equal here. So 8 into 10 to the power of 6 into a square. So this is finally this a square so this uh, a plus b whole square when uh, this divides like divides so th this is the final so put uh, a square by a plus b whole square value in this equation then you got the uh, extraction ratio which is equal to 0 0.387 so i hope uh, you all got the uh, extraction ratio which is equal to 0 0.387 so next uh, move on to the another question which is related to tributary area calculation so here a uh, question is given so write down the given uh, data here uh, center to center distance is 30 meters and uh, width equals to 4 meters and size of pillar equals to 30 point uh, so size of pillar we have to calculate so here you can see the figure here center to center distance mean a to b distance here a to b, b distance is known as center to center distance this is the distance before the galleries are driven so a to b is the center to center distance so small a small b are the solid pillow distances so we have to calculate these distances so here given that this is a gallery distance width are 4 meters so we need this one so from center to center distance we have to subtract this distance which is width distance so finally we get size of pillar equals to 26 meters 26 meters so as, as all we know that for square pillar this is the tributary area formula so then put a plus b which is the side of a 
center to center center to center distance here center to center is given as 30 meters and a which is the side of a solid pillar then both we get 224 meter square as the final answer so this is i hope you all got the answer so thank you for watching the video thank you guys if you if you have any queries just comment in the comment section thank you for watching